Pine Tiger, a popular restaurant in downtown Shreveport, is temporarily closed after yet another car crashed through their building. And KSLA News 12's Donna Kia spoke to the business owner and to state officials about the damage and the recurring issues. The Blind Tiger is picking up the pieces after a car crashed into their business over the weekend once again. Shreveport police say the crash happened after a car ran a red light and struck a Jeep, sending the Jeep into the restaurant. Fortunately, no one was hurt. The driver of the car got a ticket for running the light. For years, the possibility of installing bollards outside of the business has been discussed. Owner Glenn Brannon says he would pay out of his pocket to protect his staff, clients, and building. It's debilitating. It breaks your heart. Uh, first of all, nobody likes to be out of business even for a few days. But nobody got hurt. That's the good news. Uh, but we don't want it to be a situation where somebody does get hurt before we're allowed to put in some sort of barrier. We asked the state's Department of Transportation about how the business could go about getting a protective barrier. DOT absolutely will allow the installation of bollards um, through a permit that would be taken out and approved by our office. DOTD spokesperson Aaron Buchanan tells us the agency got a legal opinion on this in 2020 and was told there was no issue with the business taking out a permit in this situation. DOTD or the city of Shreveport wouldn't be the entities that would, you know, actually install the bollards and put them there, nor would we continue to maintain them. But the business certainly can do that. After our interview this morning, the Blind Tigers owner told us he spoke to his contractors about pulling the permits and getting the process started. They say they love where their business is located and haven't thought about changing locations. I, honestly, I don't want our legacy to be the place that gets hit by cars. I want it to be that we have great food, uh, great entertainment, that we're lots, a lot of fun. In downtown Shreveport, Donna Kia, KSLA News 12.